Good afternoon. This is Robin Bremer, author of the Kingdom Living series and the Kingdom Living Bible Study course. And uh, today I just wanted to go over um, Isaiah 32. Uh, I want to show you what I kind of, two different ways to look at this really cool scripture. Let me read it to you. Isaiah 32, uh, 17. The work of righteousness will be peace, and the effect of righteousness, quietness, and assurance forever. My people will dwell in peaceful habitations, in secure dwellings, and in quiet resting place. They'll, though hail comes down on the forest, and the city is brought low in humility. Okay. Now, oops. <laughs> one of the things, one of the ways that I use this scripture is uh, for tornadoes and bad weather. Uh, it says that we live in secure, a peaceful habitation, secure dwelling, and quiet resting place. So I claim that uh, that my house will not be burglarized, it will not be burned down, it will not uh, be um, blown away, <coughs> that nothing bad will happen to my house. <coughs> Excuse me. I don't know what that was. <laughs> um, that nothing um, bad will happen to my house because of this scripture and recently God showed me another way that we can claim this scripture and that is he often refer he said Jesus said that he was going to heaven to make a dwelling place for us another ho a house and that heaven basically is God's house and in God's house is many mansions other houses, dwelling places, like our body is a dwelling place um, for the Holy Spirit, we are a house. So he showed me to look at it that way, that, um, let's see, my people shall dwell in peaceful habitations and secure dwellings and in quiet resting places. He said we can look at that as our body, our physical body houses our spirit. Our physical body is our house for our spirit and our physical body should be a peaceful habitation for our spirit it should be a secure dwelling and a quiet resting place and he brought this um, he brought this scripture up to me when I was sick the last couple of days I I got sick I got a cold which I did battle with the whole time and I just did not overcome it like I could have or should have and I was attacked uh, uh, demonically and I share that uh, a couple days ago on on my blog but he shared me shared that scripture with me and reminded me that my body should be a peaceful dwelling place and a secure dwelling place for my spirit and for the Holy Spirit which lives inside of me I thought that was a really neat revelation I wanted to share with you so that's it for today <coughs> excuse me my name is Robin Bremer net is my website check it out subscribe on YouTube follow me on Pinterest on Twitter on Facebook uh, join my Facebook group. It's called Experience the Bible uh, because the Bible is meant to be experienced. It's not a rule book or a law book. It's a love letter uh, to a father to his kids and we are to experience everything that's in the Bible, all the supernatural stuff. So my name is Robin Bremer and I'll talk to you tomorrow.